Thursday things we're making Thursday things we're making Thursday yeah My name is Heather. Welcome to Strings and Threads. If it's your first time here, welcome. I hope that you find content here that you find enjoyable, that you like. It's all about crocheting, knitting, yarn, all that type of thing, and working together on projects, trying to do things together. It's not all about me. If you find that you like what you see here, I would appreciate if you would subscribe. It's free for you to do, and it helps the channel of the people that you like. If you're not new here, if you've been here before, welcome back, and thank you so much for returning and coming back and joining in with me. I appreciate the community. YouTube has meant so much to me and all the friendships I've made here, I can't imagine my life without them now. So thank you. Today is Things We're Making Thursday. I'm sure you heard the jingle. The jingle does a great job of explaining what it is. It's just anybody who wants to can join in with us. We have a theme for each month and then you find a pattern that you like that would match that theme. And so last month it was slippers. And so it was so exciting to see all the different slipper patterns. Some of them were knitted, some of them were crocheted, but they were all beautiful. And I'm really excited about that. This month is blankets. Before I get into blankets though, I do have a list in my description of all of the themes for the year. We already know for the whole year what we're going to do. But we had to make a change to two of the months. And I've been meaning to bring this up and I keep forgetting. So today I finally remembered. Teresa from Critters Crochet, she brought it to my attention that August is Granny Square Month. And I didn't know that. So when we picked out the themes for the month, we didn't plan accordingly. We had put for April to be Granny, something made with Granny Square Month. But we're going to switch it. April is now going to be Tritonesian Stitch. And August will be uh, make something with a granny square because it's granny square month. So in honor of granny square month, we are going to go with it and we'll do granny square projects in August. So today I don't have a blanket that I'm working on currently because truthfully, I really hate making blankets. So I thought this month I would show you some of the blankets that I have made in the past and share with you, you know, about them. So I have a Patreon account and last year on my Patreon account, we did a mystery Grafgan crochet along. It was one that I had made up and so I want to show that I'll put it right here so that you can see it and it's a dragon head. I was going to write up the pattern and sell it but I had a terrible time finding anybody who would test the pattern and I know there's probably mistakes in it because I think it's like a 20 page pattern. It's really really long because you have to write out each each row, you know, as to what it's going to be. It's probably longer than 20 page. Well, I don't know. You could fit multiple rows on a page, but still, it's a really long pattern. I haven't looked at the pattern in a while. And each time I asked, I had zero volunteers. I don't blame you. <laughs> I'm not upset. It's a quite a co commitment to volunteer to test a Grafgan pattern. So what I decided to do is I'm going to put a free copy of the pattern in my description. So if you like the blanket, feel free to, to make one for yourself for free. Anybody who wants it can have it. If you're having trouble getting it from my description, just shoot me an email. My email's in my description and I'll email you a copy of it. I can't guarantee that there's not mistakes in it because when you're working on that, that was very labor heavy. I don't know how else to describe it. It was a lot of work to make that pattern. And so that's why I was hoping to sell it because it was a lot of work. But I don't think I'm going to be able to sell it. So I am going to just give it away. But just beware that there are probably some mistakes in it. 
And if you find some and let me know, I'll fix it on the pattern so that I can have a more accurate pattern. So, you know, thank you in advance if you do that. But you don't have to. This is just something that's for fun. And yeah, so that's my blanket for this week. I thank you for watching. I hope you have a great day and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.